Friends, in this episode of By Leaps and Bounds, I am going to talk about an aspect which we find very common with youngsters these days. Youngsters refuse to believe in certain things, uh, feeling that those things are not the right things to do, just because they do not understand why those things are carried out. Now, whether it is in personal life or professional life, in order to succeed, we need to follow certain practices the way that they have been. Yes, we can have innovative ideas and want to do things differently, but certain things basically have to be done only in certain ways and these are the fundamentals for success. However, because youngsters are unable to understand and of course, the people whom they follow are also not in a position to explain why those things are being done that way, there arises a conflict and things do not get done that way. Now, I want to say that it is important to do those things in the right way and youngsters also have a right to know why those things have to be done that way. Unfortunately, many of those things have not been documented. For example, when we begin writing accounts, there is a practice of putting what we say in Tamil as Pilayarchuri and then they start writing the accounts. Even as a joke, it has been said that somebody counted that as a 2 and the accounts always exceeded by 2. Now, I am not saying that you should put it that way, but when there is nothing wrong in doing that, you pay your obeisance to God and start writing the accounts that way. This is a simple example. In your personal life, if I were to quote an example, when a child in a family suffering from chicken pox, in front of the house, they hang neem leaves. Now, this is a way of expression. This is a way of communicating to the outside world that you need to be cautious into entering into that house as that disease can spread very fast. Therefore, this has been done, the hanging of the neem leaves. Now, in order to appreciate that, we just need to understand. But if you say, how is that science? How is that important to have a string of neem leaves tied outside? Then that is a mere argument. However, even scientifically, I am told, neem has certain medicinal properties so, when the wind blows that way, it can carry those medicinal properties into the family. So, these are very simple examples as to why certain things have been done and why we need to continue such practices as they are not going to harm us at all. What youngsters need to understand? Very simple. Just because you do not understand something that is being done, do not think that it is a wrong practice. If you are really interested in knowing about it, go and seek knowledge. Find out why it has been done like this ever since the practice began. Get enlightened, but do not get upset. In order to develop by leaps and bounds, it is important to respect elders, accept their views and also channelize your energies and that is the right way forward. All these things when they come together, then you are going to reap 
rich rewards and success is yours. Let's meet again.